Hi, I'm Roberto Ramos, and this is My News Micro. Firefighters work to stop the Jake fire from spreading any further. Continuing their mission for a battle against cancer, Relay for Life creates yet another charitable event for Santa Clarita Valley. Only this time, there's a clean and spooky twist. Gilbert Melgoza is here with the story. On any normal day, the Canyon Car Wash closes at 5 p.m. But on Halloween weekend, things got a little spooky after hours. From October 29th to October 31st, they hosted a Halloween family car wash. Well, it's a haunted car wash. And this actually is uh, the brainchild of the uh, owner of the car wash um, who approached the American Cancer Society said, I know you guys can't have an event this year, but we like to support you. We want to support you. From 6 to 9 p.m., customers received a spooky best of the best express car wash for just $20 with all proceeds going to the American Cancer Society. We kind of wanted to do a, a, give it a, a haunted feel. Um, all of the donate, uh, all the uh, decorations were from uh, our volunteers. The experience included Halloween decorations, lights, effects, and music. The employees sported Halloween costumes while ACS volunteers passed out candy. They just drive up to the car wash. Um, we take their donation because it is a donation. They come right out to where our hope sign is, and that's kind of what we're all about. It's all in fun, keeping with Halloween, but also reminding people what this is all about for us. Reporting for Canyons News, I'm Gilbert Malgoza. As many families have claimed to feed in the hopes of being able to celebrate trick-or-treating, one charitable organization got creative with making their own improvised outdoor event to make Halloween fun again. Here's Moses Bergen with the story. As expected with the cancellation of national holidays this year, the night of trick-or-treating was yet another anticipated event that was negatively affected during the ongoing COVID-19 crisis. Despite the fears, the city of Santa Clarita allowed trick-or-treating with restrictions, and places such as the Moose Lodge, located in Mint Canyon, wanted to make sure that the night was fun for everyone by having volunteers create small displays using their cars on the parking lot. We asked. We sent out, we put it on our Facebook page. I sent out text messages to everybody that I know. And I just said, look, we want your help. We want the community to know that we're here for them. And let's have some fun. And fun it was. Kids and parents could arrive dressing up as their favorite characters and appreciate the creative setups that were made by each volunteer. And kids could pick out their candies from each of the volunteers' spots. It was an idea that came up when when everybody was starting to cancel Halloween. We decided we wanted to do something for the kids. So this is the idea we came up with. You know, we, we everybody was social distancing. Everybody's wearing masks and gloves to keep everything community safe. The Moose Lodge is a part of Moose International, where the organization's goals are to participate in and create charities for children and people who may need assistance for social needs. And with that being said, the lodge is open to the idea of doing trunk or treating again. I think so. I think even though it's COVID-19, I think we would still do this again because I really think that a lot of the kids are enjoying this. I'm Moises Berrigan, reporting for Canyons News. Hi, I'm Roberto Ramos, and this has been Your News Micro. Don't forget to like and subscribe all of our social media accounts. Until next time.